Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna show you guys how I apply poly gel. So first what you're gonna do is prep your nails. I already have my tips on, I do all of that off camera. So right now you see me putting the dehydrator on all of my nails and then putting the primer on top. After I do that, I'm gonna put on my Gershon base coat and then I'm gonna cure that for 60 seconds and then after that, I'm gonna put on the Gershon clear poly gel. Just to let you guys know, this base coat does give heat spikes, so make sure you put it on a low setting when you're curing it. So after I finished curing, I prepped my um, jar with my 70% isopropyl alcohol and I prepped my gel brush so I can start using the poly gel. So first what you want to do is squeeze out a good amount of the poly gel onto your finger. Then what you want to do is soak your brush into the isopropyl alcohol so it will give it enough slit. Then you want to begin to press it towards the cuticle area but put, make sure you put it thin in the cuticle area around all the sides because you don't want it too thick because it'll run into the cuticle area. Make sure you're pressing lightly and not too hard because you don't want to drag it too hard down the nail. If you feel your brush getting dry, make sure you continue to dip it in the alcohol so you'll have enough slip so you can shape it to the right shape that you want it to be. As you see, I have the excess on the end. You just take that off and just put it on a towel and you can decide to use that later or just not use it at all. Also, make sure you have a good apex because you want to make sure that your nail doesn't break. You want it to be a good strong structure. Also, try not to make the nail too thick like I did. You know, we all have something to learn from. You make mistakes and you learn from them, but Try not to make the nail too thick like I did. If you do make the nail too thick, you can always just file it down and shape it to how you want it to be. Don't forget to clean up your cuticles in the end before you cure, because you do not want that to cure on your skin. As you guys can see, my nail is mad crooked, but like I said before, you can always fix the shape. After you cure it, you can file it down to make it look better. After you cure it, you can take a lint-free wipe and wipe it down, or you can just do what I did and put some um, alcohol on the brush and just wipe over the top of the nail that you just finished curing. Okay, that's it guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know if you want more nail videos in the comments section below.